the energy vibration lays in for um, the Libran Sun Moon and Rising. It is the um, 12th week of the year 2018. The week begins from the 19th until the 25th. I want to say to you, Librans, this is going to be a week of the two first days. It's going to be water, and then you have the energy of. Uh, um fire at the end of the week okay so this is going to be wonderful and this is going to be positive so let's look at your week and let's see what is happening for you on monday you have the energy of the empress in the reverse form energy in the reverse the empress in the reverse form that means you're out of balance with your materialistic needs okay so be aware of this you liberals whatever is transparent is as if you're out of balance with your materialistic needs on Tuesday you have to deal with someone who is a water sign and this is a Pisces cancer or Scorpio it could be a man or a woman that they're seeing and um, he is going to be coming in in some form of way okay on Tuesday you have the energy of the two of Pentacles so on Wednesday you will be trying as, as if he comes in to balance to help you balance out your financial situation okay and this is really really going to be good as we look at Thursday and the crowning of the week this is going to be positive because you have the energy of the ten of cups so um, there is going to be um, a positive family situation that is coming up there is going to be a very positive situation so this week is all about family okay it's a crowning of your week and it's all about family on Friday you'll be working hard to kind of bring balance to your materialistic world because um, the energy of um, this um, uh, the Empress is in the reverse form on Monday on Saturday you have the energy of the magician now this is a good energy that comes in for you on Saturday because it's as if this a king of cups is going to come in and help you to balance out your financial situation then on Sunday we have the energy of the Queen of Pentacles we have the energy of the Queen of Pentacles on Sunday so let's walk through your week um, to see um, what is going to be transpiring so as we say your materialistic needs on Monday was you know it's it's in the reverse form whoever this um, king of whoever this king of cups is is going to come in and help you um, you both are going to be working hard to balance out whatever the situation is um, you both are going to be working hard to balance out whatever the situation is in the first half of the week okay and I need to ask and um, I'm going to ask um, what and why is um, the the Empress in reverse um, there is going to become an end to um, if some of you were out balance or some of you were using negative energies um, it's gonna end the the, the 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 energy of the debt transformation so let's see what is going to be happening why is it that the Empress is in the reverse form and you're thinking um, it's gonna be ending okay whatever hardship um, this is this is something this is this is this is <laughs> this is this is really something you know what is happening here is that um, I, I tell you you know there is something really strange going on in the energies in the, this uh, month the energy of the Empress is in the reverse form and what they're saying is basically that that's gonna come to an end like very fast you know if you were 
um, out of balance with your materialistic things that is going to be coming to an end like very fast it's as if um, this this ending of you you know have to struggle something suddenly and surprising is going to be happening unexpected development is going to be happening the sudden end of something is going to be happening so there is going to be a sudden end of if you have been feeling hardship if you have been you know like feeling hardship with something um, the heartbreak a sudden ending to whatever heartbreak you were feeling because whenever you're materialistic a thing um, whatever the materialistic thing was whatever that was happening and there was a sort of a sense from heartbreak because you feel out in the cold you you know you don't have what you need um, to balance out your life and you feel uh, you know loneliness some of you might be sick um, but this is going to be, you know, it's, it's jealousy and heartache that is going to suddenly come to an end because it is what someone is sending to you. It is what you yourself, some of you are creating this in yourself. That's why if you are jealous of someone else, um, then you block your own energy flow and this is what a lot of people do not understand once you're jealous of someone else you actually block your energy flow and people do not understand this that's why um, why are you going to be um, jealous because what is happening is that once you are jealous of someone what you create for yourself is um, what you create for yourself is a situation where um, you block yourself of anything good coming at you and this is what people needs to understand you need to stop this negative thing of you being a jealous for other people because you're actually hurting your own self and um for some people um you could this 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 king or queen or um uh, this 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 Pisces or Cancer man or woman woman who is going to come in your life is going to be someone who is going to support you and uh, um, bring warm um, love flirtation and that sort of a thing in your life this is someone this is you know whoever this King of Cups is he's going to be um, really nice to you he's going to be um, so supporting and um, you're you know it's gonna to come to an end that whatever your materialistic thing whatever you needed um, it is now going to be balanced out what I what is happening here is that um, if you people have been you know dabbling in um, if you people have been dabbling in negative energies because when a magician comes up with that it is always um, people who are dabbling in negative energies okay so um, when I said dabbling I mean that you have been um, spending your money asking people or you yourself is working negative energies against other people which means that because you're so jealous you want to block someone else from moving forward in your life in their life if you have been doing this it is coming to an end okay it is coming to an end and um, this is what is happening because a lot of people and I, I I was really not aware of what what was happening a lot of people have found out and you know there is you know this is so so a lot of people uh, pretend as if they don't know about energies and they don't know about the good and the bad and whoever out there who you were that has been blocking other people sending out negative energies to other people doing things to block other people life it's coming to an end and that's going to happen in the middle of the week in the middle of the week whoever that is out there that has been blocking other people from moving forward and you know yourself because some of you 
um, if we all know what happened in your closet and what you do when other people are not looking sorry I have to sip my coffee this is going to come to an end whoever this man or woman who is a Pisces cancer or scorpion who is coming in your life is going to help you to balance out that situation but he's gonna block you he's gonna block you it's as if this person comes in to say I know what you have been doing against someone else and I'm stopping this you have no more power over someone else it's as if this person is going to come in your life as if it's um look and they don't have to come in your life because this is the new uh, era and a lot of things people call it strange things that are happening but what is happening is that people who are manipulating energies they know how to communicate and how and Whoever you are, and you have been working negative energies, they're going to um, someone who is um, um, a fist crave of a scorpion is going to block you. You are not going to be doing it because they're going to find out that you have been blocking the Queen of Pentacles. Whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, is a is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person, and this 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 King of um, king it could be a king but it can be a woman for some people this man or woman is going to realize what you have been doing and um, he's going to block you because you have been doing to someone there's something to a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and you have been working energies and blocking that person Um, this is what you have been doing it's coming to an end okay and some of you have been doing it to this person okay all right so whoever you are it's gonna to come to an end and you're going to think Wow so ladies and gentlemen for the people who have been feeling um, negative energies from other people um, it's gonna because this is meaning that whatever the block is especially with these two this is a karmatic situation it's coming to an end some of you have been doing it to an um, a dark skin person or a dark skin person have been doing it to you and blocking your luck it's now going to come to an end if you were doing this to an earth sign person this is why the water sign person come in and said no no more we're ending the shit you're not doing this to this person anymore okay because water and earth people they love each other they protect each other this person is the water sign person is not going to let the earth sign person know that you were the one that was going that was blocking them because they are going to stand up to you and said to here and no further your powers are going to be taken away the person who have been working negative energies on this earth sign person your power is now gone you have no more power over and whatever negative energies that you were sending to this person this is over say bye bye to it because hurt sign people um, be careful of them because they carry the energy vibration of this hurt they're very powerful once they say a prayer for you may you be gone you are gone okay let's see the first half of the first the beginning of the week balancing out emotional um, situation so you have um, it's and you can see that because you have these three um, cards coming up which is uh, wonderful because I asked about the Empress in the reverse form um, the um, question was about the Empress in the reverse form and the Empress in the reverse form was it's gonna come to a fast ending and there is new love so a lot of you are going to be um, connecting with your twin flame of soulmate okay and the twin flame of soulmate so your material uh, you know the whatever wants that you ha had and it wasn't happening it's going to come to an end and then you're going to connect with someone who is very very um uh, super sweet for you okay so you're going to be balancing out a whole lot of 
emotional situation but it's gonna be good because the four of cups is his hair and this new person who is coming in your life middle of the week um, as I said in the middle of the week um, whoever out there that was working with negative energies and trying to block other people in their lives it's coming to an end okay um, and you are going to have a situation with an organization but it is as if uh, um, the organization saw what you were doing and know what you were doing it's as if this organization knew what you were doing um, and they are going to stop you okay so be aware of this this is what is going to be coming in and it you know the the air event is also um, and the pot the, the pot come up with this so it's as if you went to whatever bush doctor whoever you people believe in and whoever do this shit to you and he's gonna say no I'm not doing this anymore <laughs> he's gonna say no um, I got a message that if I you know do this to this person um, so I'm not doing this to anymore and um, and then you know he's not gonna help you anymore so you know it's gonna come it's as if he whatever because um, this is how things like these work um, whenever the angels some guide whenever um, someone pray and ask for help and the angels some guide see who is blocking that person because a lot of people in this in this lifetime and this is it when I started on my spiritual journey I was like blown away when I read and know what people were doing with the energies and that sort of a thing that people have learned to manipulate energies and they will do things and I mean I remember a little girl she said something to me and I was like whoa okay you I'm going to be careful of and whatever is happening and whoever because apparently whoever you guys went to was someone who was a water sign person who was doing your negative shit for you it's over because they're saying i am not doing it anymore i'm 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 you know i'm leaving this you know my spirit guide says i shouldn't you know work with this anymore last half of the week is that whatever the situation is you're trying to balance out a situation with um the queen of Pent the queen of pentacles um whoever the queen of pentacles is you know she is like whatever you know i don't know if i want to you know continue with you or whatever you are doing maybe if this is your partner um if this queen of pentacles was is um your partner then she is going to be you know connecting with you and bringing balance in the family but if it's a friend or something like that she's gonna say no I don't want to um, be connected with you anymore whatever the situation is um, we have balanced out the karma this is how um, earth sign people are when they're finished with you they're just finished with you the outcome is going to be um, the energy of the star in the last week some of you are going to be balancing out your situations that you have to do with earth sign people it can be your um, you know someone you could be the parents or the parents or the child or whatever that, that situation is but you're going to balance out a situation that has transpired in your life okay so um, the energy of the star comes in which your spiritual family guides are going to be coming in to balance out whatever the situation was or is um, with a family member so that you can um, balance out so it's not a bad week it's all about family for you guys it's really really all about family and it's letting you know that you are divinely protected in this time but whatever um, you know some of you were doing it's coming to an end whatever that situation whatever some of you were doing it's it's really going to come to an end now okay so I'm going to take a sip and then we're going to look at the last energy which is the wheel of fortune and this is destiny it is destiny whatever that has been happening whatever that has transpired in your life this it was just destiny it was something that comes from out a past lifetime in this lifetime and 
it is as if um, you have to um, it is as if you have to release a situation and let it go whatever the situation is or was it's as if you have to release a situation heal the situation and let it go um, it's going to be a time of um, karmatic situation that has to be ill okay um, please remember to um, listen to the second quarter oh my god it's 20 minutes but the message had to come out um, remember to listen to the second quarter reading um, the month of April May and June it's already load up and see what you're going to have listen to your Sun moon arise into this weeks and also the Sun moon arise into the next second quarter um, I know it has been long, but a message has to come out. Namaste. Until next time.